I think the right time to start a Kickstarter campaign is when you've, you know, developed your product enough that you know it's, it's good. Um, it should be different enough and you already have some fans who are willing to actually buy your product and want to see that growth. Plan everything. Plan what the rewards are, plan a timeline, uh, take, take pictures ahead of time, um, put together essentially as much of a calendar and schedule as possible. Uh, just so you don't have, well, you will have last minute moments in which you have to just kind of scramble and make something happen. But that way you can minimize as many of those as possible. Ultimately, I think that we decided to go for the higher number goal, the number that we felt was something that we really might be able to do, but really needed people's help in order to do because for lots of reasons, um, it, it introduced a real sense of urgency for us to get the word out, to have um, compelling, uh, earnest conversations with people that we thought could help us get there. Make sure that what you are making is manufacturable. So when we were doing the prototypes, we were very careful to try and um, work only with materials, equipment, uh, and ideas that we thought we could get manufactured. And then the trick is you gotta go find somebody to do it. It takes a lot of time. It takes probably more money than you think, and things are bound to go wrong, so I think be as prepared as you can, but also be prepared for failures because they're just bound to happen. Look, you're essentially opening and closing a business in one month. Hmm. Now, if you're gonna if you're gonna open a business, you're not just going to like you know open a door, put some stuff inside, and uh, you know and turn a sign and says open. You're gonna build a business plan, and you're gonna tell your friends and family, hey, in three months I'm gonna do this. It's gonna be really cool. So I think really approach it as something tangible. I never felt like there was a perfect time and at some point you really do have to just sort of jump into it and see what happens.